Hey, welcome back to Keto in the Chaos. Um, I thought I'd do a little bit uh, of expansion on my last um, video about what I eat, and I thought I'd take you through an entire week of what I ate. <laughs> so I have finished that off, and so now I'm making my intro. And I just wanted to say that I did my best and sometimes I forgot to videotape it so I just had to talk about what I ate. Um, but maybe it can give you a little bit of uh, an idea of what it's like to do keto with a, uh, intermittent fasting. Um, I have macros of 120 protein, 78 fat, and 21 carbs. And I divide them up by two each day and I really only eat two meals. Um, when I did plasma donation, I added a small extra meal of 30 grams of protein just to kind of up my protein numbers a bit and keep my hematocrit high and keep my energy up because it really does kind of suck your energy out a little bit. Um, I also added extra electrolytes that day, but I didn't really talk about that in the video. Anyway, um, I hope you enjoy it and let me know if you have any more questions and I hope that it helps give you some ideas on things you can try to join this keto journey with me. Okay, Thursdays are my crazy day. This is my first meal of the day. I'm here at my co-op school with my kids and I'm gonna be having bacon, some Dubliner cheese, chicken strips, okay. some yogurt. Um, the yogurt I'm sweetening with this stir brand. Water enhancer, it's, it's okay. It's kind of tangy. It goes okay with the yogurt. It's not my super favorite. Um, I got these strips at the grocery store pre-cooked and this Dubliner cheese is delicious. So I'm gonna look forward to this. Okay, now we're at the dance studio. Thursdays are insane. I'm basically having the same thing with a little baby bell, um, along with my Dubliner and some yogurt. And this time I'm sweetening it with Mio. And that's what I'm having for dinner. Okay, so I'm getting my plasma tomorrow, so I'm gonna do a little extra protein before bed. This is just um, 30 grams of protein of steak. Morning, it's time for some farm fresh eggs. That's what I'm cooking up for breakfast this morning. Gotta have bacon with my eggs and I found this bacon at Walmart and it's totally awesome. It's four fo um, fat and four protein and so that's what I look for. I hope it tastes good because it's totally cheap. And with my bacon, I'm gonna have some of this provolone cheese. Do two slices of this if you look it's also um, 11 and 11 and they got my Faya 0% yogurt like I always eat for breakfast pretty much every day <laughs> okay so I was in a total hurry this morning and I had to eat my food on the way over to the plasma do donation place and I just wanted to say the Walmart bacon totally sucks which is a big disappointment because it was super cheap but I guess you know what you get what you pay for and it basically tastes like turkey bacon it doesn't have near enough sodium in it it was disappointing anyway save yourself the trouble don't buy it wow something was up with the machine i had today and i ended up having to be there like an almost an extra half hour and i am absolutely beat I feel like it's taken pretty much everything out of me so i am going to have another 30 grams of protein I am too tired to make any food. I need a nap and I am just going to go ahead and drink this and hope that it helps. Okay, I totally forgot to record my dinner. <laughs> Took the girls to Chubby's restaurant. We do this every Friday night. I ordered the same thing. <laughs> Two one-third pound 90-10 patties, um, cheddar cheese, some sautéed mushrooms, sautéed onions, and tomatoes. And that's what I had for dinner and with a little side salad and with some blue cheese dressing. Okay, I totally suck at this week of eating stuff. We had a party this morning and for lunch I had tuna with mayo, two strips of bacon, um, a little bit of the Dubliner Kerrygold cheese, and some tomatoes and fresh green beans. And that was my lunch. Sorry, I didn't remember to record it. Okay, so I have like five minutes to eat my dinner, and it's right here. Um, I've got a little bit of mozzarella, some chicken, and um, some pasta sauce over spaghetti squash. I'm looking forward to eating this, but I gotta eat it quick because I gotta go. Okay, for breakfast again, two eggs, 
bacon, double in her cheese, and yogurt. Yes, this is my clean laundry that I am eating breakfast on top of. <laughs> yeah, that is my life. Okay guys, I totally forgot to video my dinner again. Um, tonight I had a 280 gram sirloin steak and a cup of broccoli. I might have a protein snack before bed, I haven't decided. Um, I am going back in for plasmapheresis again tomorrow to donate plasma and I tend to like and do better if I have a little bit of a protein snack before bed but if I do I'll try and remember to videotape it and if I don't then I apologize. Anyway, yeah, gotta go to bed now. Okay, it's like 11.30 at night and I am gonna have this, a meal. I'm gonna have an extra meal. Um, I usually do a steak, but I couldn't find one small enough and I am super tired and so I'm going for Baby Bell cheese. Um, I always make sure that I have at least 30 grams of protein um, in order for it to be a meal and not a snack because we don't snack on this way of eating. This is gonna put me over my protein macro by about 30 grams, but only over my um, fat macro by about 13, which isn't too bad, and right on on my carbs. So that's not too bad at all. Um, I'm gonna be doing plasmapheresis tomorrow. I'm gonna be donating plasma, and I like to do a little bit extra protein the night before to make sure that my protein level is up high enough. Okay, so breakfast today, I'm going for a nice rare steak and some yogurt so that I'll have a good, strong meal for my plasma donation today. Plasma days, I have extra meals, so this is what I'm gonna have today. My plasma was easy today, so it's not a big deal. Um, tuna, some tomatoes, and some Dubliner cheese. All right, dinner tonight is more of my favorite. Um, chicken with mozzarella, pasta sauce over, um, spaghetti squash. Morning. Um, this morning I'm going to sweeten my yogurt with blackberry meal. It's actually delicious. And I'm going to have two eggs, some provolone, strawberries, and bacon. Turkey soup tonight with bacon and spinach and a little heavy whipping cream. It is delicious. Wow. Breakfast today, I decided to go some for something different. I'm gonna have a little chicken with some mozzarella cheese and my bacon. Hi, so I'm sitting here waiting for two hours for my girls to finish up their ballet classes. Um, normally I go to the library, but I just wasn't feeling it today. I just wanted to sit in the car. But man, I am having some serious boredom cravings and false hunger because I know I'm not hungry. I know that I've eaten plenty to last me to dinner. I do it all the time. So I just stopped at Chevron and I actually picked up the peanut packets to read the back and to think maybe I could just have a, a small gas station meal and I thought yeah no the fat is way 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 too high on those. So that's the reason that I'm not doing nuts and just reminding myself there's just no way I can fit that into my macros. So I skipped the snacks and I went ahead and just got a bottle, a little small bottle of smart water. Um, I had my real salt and my Mio drops in my purse and decided to make myself a little sweet drink with my sodium. And I think that's doing the trick. So made it through. Anyway, if I can do it, you guys can do it. Hang in there. See you at dinner. Okay, I'm just browning up some chicken and a little grapeseed oil. And these are zoodles with spicy peppers that I'm gonna cook up to go with my chicken. I just add a little water to the chicken pan so it get some of those drippings cooking and then I'm gonna add these zoodles. Okay, and the zoodles are al dente, so they are all ready to eat. Okay, I'm just gonna add some uh, ragu brand Alfredo sauce. This is three full servings. That's the nice thing about having chicken is that you can add lots of yummy sauces to it or cheeses to it. And I'm gonna also add on here an ounce of Parmesan cheese. This looks amazing. I cannot wait to eat dinner. 
Well, thanks everybody for hanging out with me today, or this week actually, and seeing how uh, crazy my life is and seeing how fun it is and um, all the different things that I got to eat this week. Um, I'll be updating my weight in a few days and I'm excited to see if this was a good weight week for me. I think it'll be okay. and. Let me know if you have any questions or if you have any specifics that I can make a video about. I'm thinking about doing some smaller like um, videos on keto, so it would be great if you could give me some ideas on what you'd like to see. Anyway, thanks so much for stopping by and I'll see you next time.